Hello everyone. Thank you so much for tuning in. I would like to start this video by sending my love, support, and prayers to those who have lost friends and family members in the killing in the Christian church last week in Baghdad. I just pray right now for God's peace, His love, and His comfort just to be upon their lives at this time. As I watched the video of people frantically running throughout the church house in Baghdad, I thought about the condition of the American church. We know the Greek and the Hebrew. There are Bible colleges all over the country, Christian stores, Christian bookstores, uh, Christian music, Christian television, Christian radio, just about anything Christian that you could possibly ask for. But all of that would really do no good in the face of persecution. And you see, we never know when it would be our time to be persecuted. We never know when it would be our time to look persecution in the face. And so let us not only pray for those who are suffering around the world, who are being killed daily for the name of Christ, but let us go back to the basics of our faith. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. It's time for us to throw up our hands and surrender. It's time for us to come to a place of humility where we say, Lord, we need your help. We need your assistance. We can't do it on our own. So as we continue to pray for those who are suffering, who are being persecuted, let us do a self-examination. So much so that we come to the point where when persecution comes our way, we'll be able to say like Paul, for me to live is Christ and to die is gain. Thank you so much for tuning in and you be blessed.